What's up, Scorpio, and welcome to my channel. I hope all of my beautiful, my powerful, and my sexy Scorpios out there are doing well. My handsome, too. All right, Scorpio, so we're going to pull some messages from my situationship oracle, okay? So if anything resonates with you, Scorpio, don't forget to like this video. Subscribe to my channel. Also, comment. Let Blue Flame know what's going on. And if you're interested in a personal, my email will be in the description box below, okay? All right, Scorpio, let's go. Ooh, hi, right, Scorpio. So the first card that came out is thank you, next, okay? So I feel like this reading is going to be for my Scorpios that are ready to move on to the next, okay? You are ready for a new beginning, Scorpio, okay? You're ready to be with a new person, okay? A whole new person. Now, some of you guys, I feel like if this person from your past or whoever that you're currently separated with, if this person returns to you as a new person, hey, some of you guys may be willing to hear him out, okay? But I feel like this is for my Scorpios that like, nah, blue friend, we just want somebody brand new, okay? Then we have lonely, okay? So, Scorpio, I feel like you and this energy are moving on to the next, okay? Meanwhile, on the ranch, you got somebody over here that's wanting, that's missing you, Scorpio, and wanting another chance, okay? So, someone here, Scorpio, is lonely, okay? I feel like this person, Scorpio, has possibly cried over you and this connection, okay? So, I feel like this person is, like, mourning, you know what I'm saying? This connection, they, they miss you, but I feel like this person, for a lot of you guys, has not communicated to you, okay? This person is still not reached out to you, okay? But this is someone, Scorpio, that wants another chance, okay? Now, for some of you guys, this person looked at you at the time that you were dealing with them. It's just something to do, okay? This situation shift or this situation that you guys were in, it just held them over into until something better else came along, okay? So some of you guys could have been dealing like with an opportunist, okay? It was like they went to whatever female, whatever male was going to offer them the best opportunity, okay? So for some of you guys, you was kind of like that little stopping point, you know what I'm saying? They could have been dealing with other people. They could have been like on break, you know what I'm saying? Or they could have been separated for, from someone else, okay? And it's like during the time that you met them, you know what I'm saying? You was just kind of something to do. You was kind of feeling in the space until they feel like a better opportunity came along, okay? Mm. All right, messages for my Scorpio, Holy Spirit. Tell us more. What messages do you have for my beautiful Scorpios, okay? And Scorpio, whoever this person is that, that felt that you were just like, Holding them over until something else came along, okay? This is someone, Scorpio, that has been stalking you, okay? This is someone, Scorpio, that drives by your house just to see who the hell is over there, okay? Because you ain't talking to this person, Scorpio. You've moved on from this person, okay? But this person, Scorpio, has not moved on from you, okay? And sometimes, Scorpio, shit, they drive by your damn house to see who the hell you got over there, okay? I feel like this person is very curious about you, okay? But since you're not dealing with them, Scorpio, they're trying to figure out who the hell you dealing with, okay? Look at this. Block. A lot of you guys, you have blocked this person, okay? You don't block them on your phone, social media, any way you feel like this person or any way you feel, Scorpio, this person can contact you. It's like you blocked this person, you know what I'm saying? For a lot of you guys, you have blocked this person, you know what I'm saying? You made yourself with not, in, with a you didn't make yourself available, okay? I feel like for a lot of you, you always made yourself available for this person, okay? And now this person's stalking you, Scorpio, driving by your house, trying to figure out who the hell over there, who the hell you dealing with, who the hell you fucking with, Scorpio, because you ain't fucking with them, okay? And this could be someone, Scorpio, that has been energetically holding on to you, okay? I feel like for a lot of you, you possibly have been holding on to this person and this connection for a long time, okay? Because you was wanting to see what was going to happen, okay? For a lot of us, you know what I'm saying, we got to experience, you know what I'm saying, something with a person. But it's like, shit, we really didn't get a chance to see what was going to happen if we really got to come together, you know, like in a real relationship with someone, okay? So I feel like this connection or whatever you experienced with this person, it was love there. It was love between both of you guys, okay? And I feel like, Scorpio, you were holding on to this person, but you ain't holding on to this person no more, Scorpio, because you're ready to move on to the next, okay? You're looking and you're wanting new love, okay? Messages for my Scorpios, Holy Spirit. Tell us more. Messages for my Scorpios. 
All right, Scorpio, we have immature, okay? I didn't know how to handle someone real, okay? So, Scorpio, this person that you were dealing with, whether they were younger than you or they were older than you, Scorpio, this person was very immature. See, this person, Scorpio, could have been used to dealing with fake-ass people, you know what I'm saying? People, fake-ass people that's out here showing fake-ass love, okay? But see, Scorpio, you came in showing real love. You came in doing things and showing this person things, Scorpio, this person I ain't never seen before, okay? They've never experienced. What's that song I just heard about? coming a love 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 like this okay this person scorpio never experienced love like this okay but see they ain't know how to handle this shit either okay when you ain't used to experiencing shit what you gonna do with it when you get it scorpio if you got a million dollars right now what you gonna do with this shit fuck some of it up you know what i'm saying and that's exactly what this person did they weren't used to some real so they fucked it up scorpio okay but this is someone scorpio that loves you okay and this is why this person is still energetically Holding on to you, Scorpio, and holding on to this connection that they share, okay? This is why this person, Scorpio, driving by your damn house, trying to see who the hell over there because this person loves you, okay? But I feel like for a lot of you, when they had you in their life, when they had you in their energy, Scorpio, they didn't treat you like they loved you, okay? A lot of them, Scorpio, they just treated you like you was a damn option, you know what I'm saying? They can throw you up, pick you up. Put you down whenever the fuck they feel like it, okay? And I feel like shit, a lot of the Scorpio, we got tired. We was like, shit, we ain't no damn pickup toy. You just gonna pick me up and put me down whenever the hell you want to, okay? But this is someone, Scorpio, that is longing for your touch, okay? I feel like Scorpio, it's something about your body, baby, okay? This person craves, you know what I'm saying? They long for that touch, that feel. You know what I'm saying? I'm thinking of that damn, <laughs> ain't that a fabric soft little commercial? I just heard the touch. The feel, the fabric of your life. <laughs> I don't know where that came from, Scorpio, okay? But this person craves you, Scorpio, okay? Some of you guys, shit, you taste real good. And I don't care, Scorpio, we talking about a, a dang lane or a cootie kid, shit. Dang lane tastes good, too, okay? <laughs> okay, it tastes good, too. So somebody saying, yeah, I'm Scorpio, like, shit, I just want to taste you. You know what I'm saying? If I could just taste you one more time, Scorpio, if I could just feel you, like, if I could just have one more chance with you, Okay. But this is someone, Scorpio, that's trying to figure out how to get you back in their life, Scorpio, and make it right. Why, Scorpio? Because this is someone that wants another chance with you, okay? This person is lonely. So for a lot of you, if you've been wondering if this person has been dealing with people as of now, right now, Scorpio, this person ain't dealing with nobody. They're lonely, okay? Now, in the past, hell yeah, they could have had people lined up around the corner to deal with them, okay? But at this present moment, Scorpio, this person's lonely, okay? I feel like they're missing you. They miss this connection. They miss your sex. They miss your touch. They miss your feel. They miss your energy. They miss everything about my beautiful, handsome Scorpio. Hell yeah, you're going to miss a Scorpio. Shit, you don't get nothing. It ain't nothing like a Scorpio, okay? You don't come across no love, no no nothing like that. Sex, none of that. You never get that for nobody else but a motherfucking Scorpio, okay? All right, Scorpio. So let's see what signs we were feeling with you. What signs do you know how to handle somebody real, Scorpio? messages for my Scorpios, and I love you guys. Scorpio, we have Heavy Virgo, Libra, Sag. Scorpio, we have Heavy Pisces, Taurus, Capricorn. And we also have Heavy Gemini, Taurus, and Capricorn again. All right, Scorpios, that's all I have. I love you guys, and until next time, stay blessed.